Sandus Cruiser Blade is very popular among pen drives. It is compact, cheap and of good quality. But the negative thing is neither a case nor a cap is included with the pen drive. So there are high chances to damage the pen drive and lose data. So in this video we are going to make a cover for pen drive using popsicle sticks. You can make case for any pen drive using the same method. So let's get started. For this DIY we will need popsicle sticks slash ice cream sticks old book cover or box board, glue, basic stationery, scissor and cutter and sandpaper. So first we will make this kind of box like cover for the pen drive. For this I am using old book cover. I have cut a piece of it. Place the pen drive like this and make a rough marking. Now keep it in sleeping position and mark the height of the pen drive. Draw a rectangle whose sides are touching the oval. Also draw a rectangle with the height markings. Now mark the depth of the pen drive and similarly draw the rectangle. Copy the rightmost rectangle on the other side. and copy the three rectangles below the base rectangle. In total you should get nine rectangles. Cut it out. Now cut the edges which is marked with pen. Fold it to get the box like structure. Stick it properly. In the same manner, we have to make the cap for the box. So let's take the measurements. One thing to take care is while marking the height for the second box, take it little extra instead of just considering the upper part of the pen drive so that it holds the lower box properly. So both the boxes are ready. Fit the pen drive inside it and check whether it fits properly and if it does, stick it with the help of glue. I cover the upper part with sticky tape so that glue doesn't stick to it. The box has dried and is ready. Now we have to stick popsicle sticks over it. But before that make a marking on the lower part wherever the upper part ends. So we have to stick the ice cream sticks only up to this line. So now cut the sticks according to the size of the sides of the boxes and stick accordingly. 20 minutes later. So the cap of the case is ready. It looks little untidy. So to make the edges proper, I am going to make use of sandpaper. One hour later. So it's done. Also, I made the edges little bit curvy with the help of sandpaper. Similarly, let's do the bottom part of the case. Let's tidy up this. Two thousand years later. So the case is ready. It's time to color it. I want to make it look like it is made out of scrap wood. So I'm going to color it brown. You can decorate it as you want. Feel free to be creative. So the case is ready. I colored it with brown watercolor and added details with sketch pen. Also I sticked a paper to the front part where the cap goes and colored it brown. You can also varnish it to get a glossy look. I wanted the wooden feel so I'm keeping it as it is. 
so that's it for this video guys if you like the video then please share it it will just take few seconds to share and will surely help me a lot comment below if you have any queries or suggestions for future videos and subscribe to the channel for more such cool content thank you for watching see you in the next one until then stay awesome